Guwahati is the gateway to the northeast as it is the major cultural, political, educational, transportation and commercial hub of northeast India. Guwahati is known for its rich culture and tradition, celebration of festivals, cuisine, people and its cosmopolitan nature. The largest city of Assam and northeast, Guwahati is among the fastest developing cities in India. Guwahati is also known as the city of temples due to the existence of many ancient temples here. Takamakya, Basishtha and Dambakroha temples which have an existence here since ages prove the existence of Guwahati in ancient times. The Ambari excavation stressed the existence of the city to the 6th century AD. Guwahati is blessed with ancient temples, homes, lakes, museums and heritage sites. The mighty Brahmaputra river is one of the major attractions of Guwahati. Sculpture, an artistic form in which hard or plastic materials are worked into three-dimensional art objects. The designs may be embodied in freestanding objects, in relief on surfaces, or in environments ranging from tableaus to context that envelop the spectator. An enormous variety of media may be used, including clay, wax, stone, metal, fabric, glass, wood, plaster, rubber, and random found objects. Materials may be carved, modeled, molded, cast, wrought, welded, sewn, assembled or otherwise shaped and combined. The old architecture of Assam usually refers to the monasteries and temples built in ancient times. They as well as various the royal palace, castle, also bear the signature of architecture. At that time, various statues and cultures, such as stone pelting designs, etc., introduced the sculpture of ancient Assam. I'm 
हमारे बाराई आर्ट एंड कल्चर प्रतिष्ठान की मूवी उत्तुक्ता शिल्पी जीजन शिवनाथ बाराई तथा जन्म होमर गोलपारा जिलार गोलपारा शहर तार पे शिक्षा ग्रहण कर रवींद्र भारती विश्वविद्यालय कलिकतार नाइन्टीन नाइन्टी वान शिक्षा ग्रहण कर आर्ट एंड कल्चार ऊपर विभिन्न कम काज चल जाए दुहजार बार तेर सन सोनपुर गिन्न धरण जीव जंतु मूर्ति ह्यूमेन कल्चार एनिमेल कल्चार विभिन्न आर्टिस्टिक सामग्री सब इतना प्रडक्शन कर क्षतिग्रस्त हबलियामी शिल्पी क्षतिग्रस्त हबलिया जदिव व्यवसायिक प्रतिष्ठान तथा शिल्पी सुलभ मनोभवेरे प्रतिष्ठान चलने मानु शिल्पी इतना जड़ित मानुखी जाते चल पारे भविष्य निजर पर भरण पोषण पोहपाल दी पारे तार कारण आम सहको चेस्ा चला architecture initially began as oral local architecture that evolved from trial and error to successful replication to potamoti etia to clear modeling to korute time lage clear modeling to hoi gaya kichu baki hoye casting process casting process ko beshi time lage casting ko tumar alok mana last time hale je te finishing hoy etia part bila drawing kori grinding policing hoy मेटेल डेमेज न दस बार बस क्या कलर चेन्ज कर मेटेलोटी 
महात्मा गांधी ये भी कम्प्लीट ही है ये भी पीओपी में है मट्टी में पहले बनता है फिर इसका फर्मा लिया जाता है फर्मा लेने के बाद में ये टाइस से फिर इसको पीओपी में ट्रांसफर करके फिर पीओपी में बनाया गया है ऐसे ही है इसका भी प्रोसेस है ये भूपेन हजेरी का और ये है खोकेन दास जो इनका पिताजी है जो भी काम कर रहे हैं इनका ये लड़का मान लीजिए नहीं खोकेन दास इनका ही नाम है असल की मृत्यु आगे कम बहुत बहुत लक्ष्मीनाथ बेजबुरा बन गपारा विष्णुरबाणी बहुत खी The history of Assam sculpture is very old. Various ancient notes and inscriptions depict the various monasteries of ancient Kamrupa and its architectural sculptures. The Middle Ages were very magnificent in architectural sculpture and paintings. This practice of architectural sculpture which began in the historical period has been used as a way to express culture for civilizations on seven continents. Architecture initially began as oral local architecture. that evolved from trial and error to successful replication sculpture can use any materials or processes that our current technology provides from stone to electronics and light itself